Lubbock ISD students spent all of last school year building a house for Habitat for Humanity. And then yesterday, several groups came together to bring that 80 ton home to the other side of town, which took four hours traveling at 15 miles an hour. KBK's Elizabeth Fitz joined them on their journey. It takes so much uh, effort and coordination. LISD is tremendously wonderful to us. We also must coordinate with the house movers. We're so grateful for Integrity Moving stepping up today for us, Sean and his crew, because it's hard to find house movers. Then we also have to have our team on board. Uh, the city of Lubbock helps us. The police are here. So it's just an all out effort and we are so appreciative to everybody. But it took more than these volunteers to get the 80 ton home across the city. You got to get a permit and there's processes and things the city require and lots of insurance and things like that. But but mainly just a lot of fortitude. Both labor and fuel are very expensive and our insurance has seen since the pandemic. Insurance uh, quotes for large vehicles doing things like this have substantially risen. In the most difficult part of the trek. It's all the power lines. This. They're just all too low for really doing this. Derek Ochoa and his brother Ryan led the trip, communicating with each other the entire way. And it is a team effort. Ryan's really good at driving. I'm really good at directing, but it's, it takes two to make it all happen. It feels good to be able to help other people out when, I mean, everybody knows the housing industry is just insane. The fact that they're able to do what they do and the fact that they are willing to let us help them accomplish their goal just is a good, good thing. Wow, I want to know where they got that big old truck from. That's amazing. And uh, this wonderful service is going to continue through the next school year as hundreds of Lubbock ISD students are going to work on another house for Habitat for Humanity. Awesome work by those kiddos. Super, super neat. I love to see that story. And it's just amazing that they're able to move the entire buildings yeah. across town. Just incredible stuff. Yeah, absolutely. Now we are hoping that what we got 